Hi Virgo, I'm Shire from Charlie's Angel Tarot and welcome to the channel. If you're a new viewer, um, please subscribe and hit the bell so that you can be notified when I go live or when new videos are loaded up. And if you are a Cyber Angel, welcome back and thank you very much for your support, my uh, faithful viewer. And this is your, um, Virgo, this is your uh, romance vlog for March 2020 and I hope you will enjoy it there are I'm late I'm sorry about that but there's new things happening and there is a video on the end screen that you can watch news and update and um, also other examples or that you can click on and also a white little circle here in the tops that if you click on that it will take you through to the website Charlie's Angel uh, tarot.com and you can see the re reviews and the latest bits of news there as well I haven't updated it this week yet so forgive me for my voice <coughs> um, but uh, have a scout around on the website and you can see what different readings are on offer if you get an extended reading then you can have uh, a, a, an update uh, within the next six months and um, that will be um, not so expensive as an extensive reading so perhaps you might be interested in that be it a general reading or a romance reading and of course um, we uh, we have the live sessions now on Monday and Friday in English and on Wednesday in Dutch so if you know Dutch by any chance then uh, you're more than welcome to join on Wednesday evenings as well in the live session in the live session there is super chat and super stickers available do you have a question or would like to jump the line then you can do that after a donation and I will answer your question with three cards and an oracle card I am going to translate this introduction as well in Dutch and then I'll be back as the reading is in English so enjoy this reading and please share with family and friends and give us the thumbs up and I hope to see you in the live and if not in the next video. Hallo iedereen, een lieve maagd. Dit is jullie vlog voor maart, de romantische vlog voor maart. Er zijn nieuwe ontwikkelingen en aan het eind van de eindscherm daar zie je ook um, nieuws en update. Klik daar even op, dan weet je wat nieuw is en wat er gaat gebeuren in de komende maanden en weken. Um, Ik heb nu uh, uh, alleen maar drie avonden dat ik live ga. Dat is op maandag en vrijdag in Engels en op woensdag in Nederlands. Zo uh, ken je iemand die ook geïnteresseerd is in uh, Tarot of Lenneman. Uh, deel dan deze kanaal met je vrienden en familie. En geef ons de duimpjes op. En um, vertel ze ook om lid te worden en ook op de bel te klikken. Dan worden ze genotificeerd wanneer ik uh, live ga. Uh, het Nederlandse is op woensdagavond. Zo, so, ik hoop je daar te zien. En ook nieuwe mensen natuurlijk. De, het, de familie, de cyberfamilie familie is heel groot aan het groeien. En daarom heb ik gekozen om... Uh, twee Engelse avonden te doen en één Nederlandse maar het moet wel haalbaar zijn zo laten we alsjeblieft een heleboel Nederlanders bij elkaar blijven want ik heb het heel erg druk want er is ook nog een website en er gaan leuke dingen gebeuren er komt een serie van vlogs met een Nederlandse heks en wat doen heksen wat betekent de tekens want we zijn een uh, een heksen orakel aan het discussiëren en uitleggen over tekens en waar staat het voor enzovoort enzovoort ik heb hele positieve reacties gehad zo dat ga, daar gaan we samen um, Wendy en ik die werken samen Wendy is een Nederlandse heks en um, wat is het verschil tussen een heks en een, um, uh, een herbalist uh, een alternatieve dokter of een moleculaire arts. Die werken ook met uh, moeder aarde en kruiden van moeder aarde. 
So, dat is, zijn uh, interessante onderwerpen en ik vind het ook leuk om discussies te hebben. Als je mij volgt, dan ken je dat. Dan weet je dat, dat we ook wel discussies hebben in de live sessies. En misschien ga ik wel een extra uh, live doen met betrekking tot antwoorden en vragen van, uh, naar aanleiding van de... Uh, de interviews. En ik ga ook interviews doen met auteuren. En zo, uh, er zijn hele leuke dingen gaande. En ik hoop dat je mee wilt doen. Maar ik ga nu terug in Engels uh, deze lezing doen. Jullie kunnen de ondertitelingen aanzetten uh, als je geen Engels kan. En ik doe het in Engels omdat ik lees voor rond de hele wereld. Zo, so, ik hoop dat je het leuk vindt en ik hoop dat je uh, lid wordt en ik hoop dat je uh, in de live zal komen en dan kan je ook een cyber engel worden, officieel. Zo, <laughs> so, hier gaan we. Geniet ervan en tot ziens. Hi, so the first card that you have, Virgo, is healing family issues. Family issues can of course be uh, loss of somebody, uh, can be about money, can be about work, not spending enough time together. Your life benefits as you forgive your parents. It doesn't, it doesn't mean your parents, but also your parents-in-law. Uh, and they can be an issue as well. So you have to most probably tweak or tweet something with regarding to family issues. Um, it could be a pregnancy. Um, as you've got the stalk, so if you are if you're not hooked up, then it, perhaps it is family issues um, that when you do meet somebody, they're never any good. Blah blah blah, things like that. But um, don't worry, there is a new beginning coming. There could be a birth. This could be of a child, or this could be of a job. So perhaps you haven't got a job or your partner hasn't got a job and that could be issues in the family as well. With regard to finances, here you can see the stalk, he's holding a little devil, a little man with a suitcase. This could be the doctor's case or this could be an advocate or a bookkeeper's case. Or it could be their case that they want to take to work because they're starting a new job. The stalk also means... Um, Moving home, it could also be uh, a 300 degrees turnaround in a situation and or in a in an issue, and that is that's it's going to turn around for you from negative to positive, so long you deal with it, so that you can heal. The stalk also means new beginnings, like I said. And in this card, this stalker's got big boots on. So take the first step, put those boots or sh naughty shoes on and go forwards. I love the way um, Monica Berinsky has depicted it. <laughs> I, it looks like the Adams Family. It reminds me of the Am Adams Family series. So if you would like to ha have an extensive look at the deck, go and have a look at the review playlist. It is uh, safe for you to love. Okay. Open your heart to give and receive the highest energy of all, whether you are hooked up or not. Open your heart, open your solar plex so that you can laugh and have fun. Let your inner child out. <coughs> Let your inner child, excuse me, let your inner child out. Okay, something is going to happen. It is safe for you to love. Don't be scared. Okay, you're going to receive news. And this could be news of a birth, like I said, or of a job. It could be official news. You could be perhaps asked to get engaged. That is engaged or get married or move home. You, this, this mortgage might come through, so you might be moving in together. So, wow, beautiful. <clears throat> Family issues will be healed. That could be also the news.
There is definitely a lot of chemistry in the third week. Passion might be high in the third week. There is a strong magnetic attraction here. Whether you are uh, already hooked up for years or months or weeks or just new. Remember, there might be a lot of passion in the third week, but it could be the energy throughout the whole month because it looks quite active. If you don't want to get pregnant, then take precautions because this is a pregnancy card and this is a pregnancy card because you've got the sun and the sun means moving home, going on holiday <clears throat> and also stability because one and three means four and four is proper foundations and stability like a house. Um, uh, you're also in the limelight and something has been illuminated because the moon, the sun and the star is um, a light, uh, shines light. So something is being illuminated. Perhaps your wish, perhaps family issues. So get them cleared up and it is positive. Definitely a positive card. So there will be family issues might be highlighted or illuminated so there again it is confirming the first card beautiful your relationship might go up a level also it again um, confirming that it is not just passion it's safe for you to love wow or you might go up uh, a level in your job or your partner might go up in uh, to the next level promoted at a job that could be the official news that will make you happy and there won't be any family issues it won't just be chemistry it will be a fully fledged relationship perhaps you might be getting married it could be a Leo that's interested in you or sending you news make an effort make an effort show that you care that you love open your heart create lo um, great love is worth taking the steps you are guided to take Virgo so let the universe and the angels um, guide you and you have number 38 and this is the Monica does call this an oracle deck but it is in fact the Lenaman and you've got the lantern showing you the light again something is being illuminated <coughs> the lantern overall means uh, like the the moon and the sun um, showing you the light also this card reminds me of the hermit perhaps it is time to sit back and shine your light on your issue and to solve the issue meditate contemplate and evaluate this situation where are you going to go let the light show you the lantern will light your way when you are in the dark the card shows up when the time is right to seek spiritual or esoterical enlightenment and knowledge that you are longing for often nighttime and dreams are where you will receive spiritual messages a candle meditation may be called for sit with a candle to meditate on what it is you truly want in your life moving forward or to improve this may <coughs> this may is a time all right uh, sorry this may be the time it's a type fault because I'm still learning the new cards but I'm like I said it's, it reminds me of the hermit so my definition is nearly the same but I'm just reading this for you for extra information this may be the time of transformation or perhaps you would like to do a pilgrimage go back to somewhere that you have been before where you feel comfortable and lucky to contemplate so sit down somewhere and make the effort perhaps you want to make the effort on how to go forward like the hermit let the light shine on it underneath the deck you have the ring there will be a partnership formed here 
okay perhaps the family issue is that the family wants you to get married or him or your partner to ask you to get married there will be a partnership you've got number 25 there as well so that means luck is on your side the overall energy um, for in the romance card is calling in your soulmate your prayers and affirmations and visualizations help you to bring you together so if you don't know how to contemplate or visualize or meditate then make a visionary board and a download uh, pictures from Google or old magazines to visualize stick this board somewhere um, that you pass several times a day like with magnets on um, the fridge um, uh, and let the angels and the divine and the universe know <clears throat> uh, what it is you would like or wish for or your goal then you've got a spiritual card so you have got very spiritual um, messages coming to you or you might be a spiritual yourself you might be a psychic yourself or listen to your intuitions you might be more emotional this month listen to your new ideas when you do sit down in quiet contemplation wow the three gifts of light the white light, delight and lightheartedness. Let your inner child come in, open your heart and solar plex. Archangel Michael hands you an energetic key. This sacred key brings you the three gifts of light. They allow you to feel joy in your heart and life and live happily in the here and now. So, let them know what you want, then you will have light delights and light heartedness. You've got the mauve angel feather, you've got a mauve card, the golden key. Use that key wisely to open up the doors and close the doors on negativity. Courage and faith, the angels are present and call upon you to be courageous draw on and trust in your deep faith spiritual beliefs and the angels to and the angels to assist you at this time wow what did i say your spirituality might be heightened wow go for it have faith and courage that everything is going to turn out all right and the partnership will the bond will grow and go up a next level awesome Okay, Virgo, I hope you have enjoyed this reading and I hope you will join me in the life. If I don't see you in the life, I will see you in the next video. Please share this video with family and friends and let's get growing. Bigger, 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 bigger. I love you all, my cyber angels. Take care and be blessed. Ciao, ciao.